boy, you better learn that for that. Yeah, boy, you better learn that for that. I finna my way to the chest. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy King J coming at y'all with another video today, man. And before we even get into today's video, man, let me let y'all know right now. Your boy be streaming on Twitch every single day. So if you want to support me, if you want to check out all my live stream, man, the link is in the description. Go follow me on Twitch. Now, in today's video, man, from the previous video I dropped about the YVN server, I'm gonna let y'all know today every useful thing and everything that you need in order to play ybn ls servers successfully now the thing that you're gonna need in this particular video to play on the ybn server is the ybn launcher you gotta have toco vip plugin and you gotta have team speak 3 and for a little tip just because i mess with y'all boys so heavy man i will be showing y'all boys how to play with the controller on pc so now let's go ahead and get into it now the first things first you have to be accepted into the YBN community. Now, if you're not a whitelist application, you have been accepted, go watch my previous video. It will tell you guys exactly how to get accepted and everything that you need to do. And also, man, if you got accepted from my last video, man, comment down in the comment section. I wanna know if I helped anybody out. Now, the next thing's next. Once you get accepted, let's just say you get accepted. The first thing that you need to do is make sure you are in the YBN Discord, okay? I'm gonna put that link in the description for y'all. Next thing that you need to do is you wanna come into the server, right? You wanna go into the Discord, right? Once you come into the Discord, the first thing that you wanna do is go over to where it says server information. From here, it will tell you, in order to play on the Lost Scandalous Roleplay, you need to follow TeamSpeak 3, Toco VIP plugin, and the YBN Lost Scandalous Launcher, okay? If you don't have these installed, you can't play. So the first thing, like I said, I shout out to YBN for even making it so easy and so helpful. So the first thing that you need to do is go ahead and click on the YBN Lost Scandalous Launcher. You wanna click on that. What it's gonna do is gonna take you to a link, and I'm gonna show y'all everything that y'all need to do real quick all right so once you guys click that it's going to take you to a web browser where you're going to download the ybn launcher all you simply need to do is download the ybn launcher and make sure it's installed so from there i'm going to show you guys in order for you to actually get into the server you can't join out the ip anymore because people like to ddos for some odd reason what you have to do is have the launcher installed onto your pc and then what you want to do from there and i'm going to show you exactly how it's done once let's just say that you have it installed you want the next thing you want to do is open it up all right so once you have the ybn in launcher download it's gonna look something like this on your computer okay from here all you simply have to do is click on play game and it's gonna launch 5m and it's gonna be able to put you guys in the server this is the only way that you can get inside of the YBN LS server okay you have to download the YBN launcher have to have it installed and you must come here and you have to click play but before you guys do that we need to install TeamSpeak 3 and we got to install Toco VIP and let me show you exactly how to do that so from here the first thing that you guys want to do is go click on TeamSpeak 3 it's gonna take you to another link where you want to come to and I'm gonna let me show you guys exactly what I'm talking about here so from here, once you're on the, from this website, all you want to simply do is download the client 64 bit, all right? And this is version 3.5.3, okay? You want to simply download that, follow the instructions, and install it, okay? So once you download TeamSpeak, all right? Simply just follow through the little steps that they have on there and install it into your PC. All right, once you do have it installed and everything like that, you want to make sure your TeamSpeak is closed because the next thing that you want to do now is you want to download Toco VIP plugin. What's going on guys? In the midst of me making this video, YBN did update their team speak to an updated version. So in order for you guys to get that download link, what you have to do is go up in the YBN Discord, okay? You wanna go in the community, you wanna go to general. All right, then what you wanna do is go to where it says pinned messages, and you simply wanna click on this uh, message right here, uh, Toco VOP version 1.5.4. Make sure you go ahead and click on that. It's gonna automatically download it for you. Make sure it's installed, make sure team speak is closed, and you simply wanna go into the next step. So once you click on the link, it's gonna take you to another website where it's gonna automatically download the Toco VIP plugin for you. All you simply have to do is install it, and it's gonna be very, very simple. So once you do that, it's gonna be very, very easy the next thing that you wanna do. All right, so once you have everything downloaded and installed, what you wanna do next is open up TeamSpeak 3, it's gonna bring you to a page like this. Next thing that you wanna do is go over to where it says connections and then you wanna, you wanna click on connect. Now, you see where it says server nickname or address, what you wanna do is go into the YBN Discord, right? 
Go to where it says frequently asked questions and you want to slide all the way up to where you see number three to where it says how do I download Toco BLP. Alright, so what you want to do is where it says connect to the TeamSpeak server at, you want to copy this website right here. You want to copy, this is the server nickname. So you want to copy this right here, control C, and you want to come up here to the top and you want to simply just paste. Simple, just like that. All right, so where it says nickname now, this is very, very critical here. You wanna put your nickname as your character's name, your in character's name. Whatever you submit your application with, that character's name, put that. So for instance, my name is Dante Williams. All right, so after that, all you wanna do is simply press on connect. All right, and as you guys can see, I'm connecting, I'm in a AFK. All right, so now the thing is, and I'm gonna show you guys this in a few minutes. I'm gonna show you all the settings and everything first. So this is how you connect. Now, once you wanna always do this before you launch the game, okay? Before you, a lot of people seem to mess up and they'll launch the game and they won't have TeamSpeak open. What I do, what works for me, I will open up TeamSpeak first. I just have it running. I don't I don't even connect you. I just have it running, okay? Once I have it running, then I launch the game, okay? I, I launch YB and launch, I press play game. I let the game load up. Once I get into the city, I come back here and I go to connections and I go to connect. And then I connect to the server, right? I connect to the server. From there, once you're in the game, it's still gonna say Toko not connected. What you wanna do from there is go to where it says plugins, Toko VIP, then you press on connect. That is how you move in game. You cannot move, you cannot press connect until you're actually in the server, okay? And I'm gonna show you an example of what I mean by that in a few minutes. So, bro, as you guys can hear the sounds or maybe you cannot, what you wanna do from here, just for the best settings, you wanna go to self, sound pack, and then you want to go to where it says sound deactivated. This is going to stop this lady from talking. She talks and say connected, connected, connected. She'll be saying that a lot. So in order for her to stop saying that, you want to go to self, sound pack, and you want to go to sound deactivated. That way you won't hear anything. All right, next, what you want to do is go to where it says tools. You want to go to options. From here, ladies and gentlemen, let me show you exactly how to set up the best options for your optimal settings, okay? So where it says capture, it's going to tell you where you know how you set up your mic and stuff like that so capture mine is i want to show y'all mine is capture mode is automatically use best mode and my capture device is my yeti that i'm using currently right now so in order for you like to change your mics or anything like that you want to come up in here and it's going to list you all your mics and stuff like that so you can do that so whatever you want to use for people to hear you you want to come here to capture device and you want to change it to that and then make sure you have activation set to push to talk. You have to have it on push to talk. And now in order for you, for your button, for whatever you want to press, so that then it'll start recording your voice, you want to come here. I have mine set to end for default. All right, and you want to have everything just like this, just copy my settings. Now, playback is your speakers, okay? I have my speakers on right now, and I, if I want to change to my headphones, I will come back to playback device and do it just like that. So again, voice volume adjustment, have it just like this, have all your sounds and everything just like my settings I have here, okay? And that is all you have to do. Now again, I'm going to show you real quick exactly how I set up you know, when I'm about to join the YBN server, I'm gonna show you guys exactly how it's done. All right, so I'm gonna do this from scratch. Everybody, you must follow these steps, okay? Once you open up your PC, the first thing that you wanna do every single time is launch Steam, okay? I always launch Steam because for some odd reason, if you don't have your Steam opened up before you launch 5M, it's not gonna work. So I always wanna have my Steam launch. I open it up and then I close it down, just like so. All right, from here, I click on my YBN launcher, let it load up and everything like that. Make sure everything is you know working good. Make sure I have everything doing good. I have my YBN launcher, boom, so I have it up. Well, next thing I do, I open up TeamSpeak. Have it open up, let me minimize that for you guys. I have it open up and I have it sitting right here. Next, what I like to do is I like to get my, my controller settings as well. And I'm gonna show you guys right at the end of the video how to set up your controller, don't worry. I have input mapper. I like to set it, I like to have this open as well. All right, so the next thing I like to do is I wanna click on play game. That's gonna launch the game for me. I'm gonna show you guys how everything is done. How This is how I do it every time. And you wanna do this every single time in order to get in successfully, okay? But thank the Lord, there's no, there's no queue. So since there is no queue, I'm gonna get right on in. And I'm gonna show y'all exactly what I mean by with how to connect to the Toco VIP and everything like that, because a lot of people don't know. All right, so we're here. Once you come here, what I like to do is I like to press enter right here, right? And as you can see in the background, it says that my plugin is not even on. So what I like to do is I like to come here, bring it up right here. I go to connections, connect. It's already in there for me. I go to connect. All right, boom, connect, right? But as you can see, I'm in the AFK channel. In order for me to move up to in game, 
what I want to do is go to plugins, Toco VIP, connect. Look at the background now. Watch the background change. Channel is switched. Now I am inside of the game, okay? Now I'm inside. So what I want to do again, go to self, sound pack, and you want to go to sound deactivated, okay? From here, well, you, you can leave that alone. You're in there and now you're good. So if this is your first time, I'm gonna show you exactly what you need to do so you won't mess up. Cause a lot of people will come in here and they will mess up with this one little thing. So you can go to, let's just say, I'm gonna go to here. Because I know nobody gonna go in there. Spun in. You know what I'm saying? So what you wanna do, come to escape, all right? All right, so what you wanna do is go down to set, you wanna come to settings and go down to where it says voice chat. Voice chat enabled, cut that off, okay? If you come, make sure that this is cut off. You only have to do this one time. Cause if you come in there and you have this on, everybody in the whole server is gonna hear you and you're gonna get yelled out. So make sure you cut that off. Now, let me show you all my settings real quick so that you guys can get a look at that as well. So what I have for my uh, graphics is I have a direct, direct X11. Some people like to use that, some people like to use 10. Um, I have the render resolution right here. I'll put monitor, have everything, have my pop. I have a good PC kind of, I have 16 gigabytes of RAM. So I had to upgrade in order for me to even play this game successfully. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Make sure you have some RAM, okay? That is that is gonna be the key thing when it comes to this game is RAM. All right, texture quality is normal. I have all my settings on normal, okay? Everything is on normal. I'm gonna go by a little bit slow so people, if people need to copy this. But that is it, ladies and gentlemen. That is how I have my settings and everything like that. And that's how I get Toco VIP to work every single time. So now, with that being said, all right, ladies and gentlemen, so this is how I play with controller on PC for Grand Theft Auto 5. All right, so what you wanna do is click this link in the description, inputmapper.com. And what you wanna do is come over to where it says input mapper 1.7 and go to more info. Now, if, he, if you're having trouble with that, simply go to input mapper 1.6 and just go to the downloads, very, very simple. So when you come here and click on more info, it's just gonna say there's nothing here. So what you wanna do is slide down to where it says input mapper 1.7 more info. You wanna come over here, simple stuff like that. And all you wanna do is simply click on download. Now this is an updated version, ladies and gentlemen. I have not used that personally myself, but I'm about to try it right now. And I will let you guys know in the next video how it works. But for what I'm seeing for right now, it looks like a better version. And for the people that's gonna download 1.6, it's simple. Once you download it, all you have to do is simply plug in your controller using USB to your PC, and that's simply it. Make sure you have it done just like I showed you guys in my video, and you guys will be good to go. All right, so everything seems to be working with Input Mapper 1.7, so I highly suggest it. That link will be in the description to go download it. So again, guys, if I helped you out at all, please drop a comment, drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and make sure y'all go follow my Twitch link was in the description. If you have any other questions or concerns, please let me know in the comment section that, or just follow me on Twitter and DM me. I will help you guys out. It's been real. It's been your boy, King J. Thank y'all so much for tuning in, man. I hope y'all have fun playing YBN, man. Get